What's up guys, today we'll be transferring files between two computers and first and foremost I want to thank all the loyal fans who have been keeping who have been keeping the site running the Ninotech channel running and I want to shout out to the new subscribers like this Momo44 says then the Pablo Rango then you have Stabo Young Slim shout out to all the new subscribers and all the loyal fans of Ninotech KE thank you very much and keep watching so today we'll be transferring files between two computers go to Google then you search for the software tool that will help us transfer a file Ducto that is Ducto it is located in a site known as SourceForge the site is known as SourceForge.net they will download our software this is the first link so just click on the first link and wait for it to load then we have Ducto right there you can see it has 12 18 downloads this week hit the down the green download button to download your software tool as you can see it is downloading and will be presented to us shortly It's a small tool and won't take long to download, around 5 MBs. You can just click and open the software tool to install it. Just hit next, next till the end. Next. then install as you can see it is already installed just finish from there you need to ensure the two devices are connected to the same network the two devices should be connected to the same network so that you can be able to transfer your files no matter the file size it will be able to transfer so open the Ducto application then you ensure that both devices have the application opened so that you can transfer your files as you can see there there are two computers or devices indicated that the sender and receiver on the Ducto application and they are connected to the home home name of the Wi-Fi so you can just select the folder location in which you want to transfer to You need to ensure the devices are on the same network or it can be a hotspot. All the devices should be on the same network. By network, I just mean that you are connected to one Wi Fi, the same Wi Fi. Or you can have one device serving the other device for example one device can be a hotspot and the other device can connect to the hotspot and 
ensure the Ducto application is open on both devices. This will ensure a smooth operation, a smooth sending of files between the two devices. Now we can just transfer any file to the other device. So stick around and watch the transfer. So to transfer a file, you just go to the file location. Then you can just drag and drop the file or folder that you need to transfer. For example, that was a small file, it went so fast. You can pick a larger file or folder, drag and drop. Let me go back first. And drag and drop. As you can see, it is transferring the folder to the other machine. Quite a good tool because it can send up to, it is not limited in the size that can be transferred. Just any file that you need to transfer, Ducto has got you covered. So with this transfer, we've gone quite well. We'll go to confirm if it went to the other machine. I selected the readme vid folder. So after it finishes, we'll go to confirm if it's available in the next machine. So let's go to the demonstration to understand how this works. As you can see, here is the website for downloading Ducto, sourceforge.net. We've already downloaded the Ducto app and we'll just install it. For those who missed the installation part, just say yes to the user account <laughs> control. So on the setup, just say next, next install. After it's done, you can open the application to transfer your files. This is the receiving machine. Allow access to bypass the Windows Defender firewall. Just allow access. Disclaimer, you can read that disclaimer. Just accept. And if it's connected to the same network or Wi Fi, you'll see the two devices being displayed the sender and the receiver. There are our two devices. Just open Ducto in both both the devices. From here we can smoothly transfer our files. We're waiting for the device to come up. Confirming whether it's the same network. So here is the second device being displayed on the Ducto app. It does not take time to display. So as you can see on both devices, we have the same network or Wi-Fi name. So all you have to do is just drag and drop the file to the Ducto app to transfer it to the other machine. You can change the folder can change the folder where you'll be storing the 
file transferred so you can change just or we can just leave it at desktop you can change the color if you want to just leave it at the desktop you can see Ducto is open on both the devices so just drag and drop a file or folder to transfer it it doesn't require any password or anything whatsoever as easy as that you can see our file being transferred and this one is receiving the data our file is received let's go to the desktop and check whether it's there as you can see we have a file right there and our original file is still present on our videos folder as easy as that Ducto has made us transfer files between two computers so this is the simple way and you can leave a like <coughs> so you can just leave a comment down in the description box if you need any explanation I will leave the links in the description so that you can download the Ducto app from the link Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe if you are new to this channel and leave a like so that you can hack the YouTube algorithm ethically with this video.